Wilbert Mora emigrated here to New York from the Dominican Republic when he was just a boy. His big brother said Wilbert was always considered the baby, even when he grew to be six foot three. He was the first New York City police officer in his family. Dear Wilbert, I never got the chance to tell you how truly special I thought you were. Not an ounce of meanness in your whole body, that I was always proud of you. You chose a life of service to your community and to our adopted country. The police commissioner called it an ocean of officers that shouldn't have to line the streets for a second time in five days. Freeze it! Oh. All of us witnessing a mother's profound pain. A solemn tribute was paid to a 27-year-old immigrant named Wilbert Mora. He had left the Dominican Republic when he was just a boy, emigrating to New York and marking childhood milestones so many of us cherish. He wasn't supposed to die this young. Know that Wilbert went out fighting. The commanding officer at Wilbert Mora's 32nd Precinct recalling how Mora took rookies like Jason Rivera under his wing. The two of them facing a stolen gun and a disturbed man in a narrow hallway on January 21st. He didn't freeze, but fought back, trying to stop the threat. Police Commissioner Keyshawn Sewell continued tradition and promoted Wilbert Mora posthumously to detective first grade. And the entire Mora family was hailed for donating Wilbert's heart, liver, kidneys, and pancreas so that others could live. The decision wasn't easy. I watched as a mother laid her head against the chest of her son to hear his heartbeat. When you raised your head, you made a courageous decision. You made a decision to save others' lives. It took every ounce of courage for this grieving mother to stand on the steps of St. Patrick's as her son's hearse was led away. The officer's older sister had spoken in the family's Spanish language to ask the questions we're all asking after six police shootings since January 1st. ¿Cuántos Wilber? ¿Cuántos Jason? How many Wilberts? How many Jasons? Before the gunfire finally stops. At the beginning of the funeral, the mayor spoke of a police officer shot and wounded last night in Queens on his way to work. It is New Yorkers against the killers, the mayor said, and we will not lose.